Divine Masculine, okay, let's see what's going on with you today. Let's see, Father, what is their situation for Divine Masculine? I'm just hearing so many fears. It's like you're scared. <laughs> this love is like, whoa, it's shocking you. It's like, how could I feel this way about somebody? Like, still, is what I'm hearing. And for some of you, it's like, whoa, this love is like taking me by storm. It's taking you fast, is what I'm hearing, okay? What's the situation that fell? Obstacles and challenges. Again, that number five as well. You're going through a few obstacles right now, and it's challenging. I'm here challenging to get through these fears. You're like, whoa, what if I fall? What if what if something breaks? What if what if this isn't what they what if I can't be what they expect me to be? Or what if I'm what if they're not who I expect them to be? Whatever the case is, you're going through these obstacles. But God is saying that you're getting through them. Okay, that's the second or third time that I've I've seen this card come up for Divine Masculine. Your action, what it is, your action, triumphant success. So speaking your truth, standing in your power, manifesting, knowing your intuition, number one is here. So 111 is all about your intuition, using that, okay? Knowing that this will be a success. I just said that. I just said your situation is you're like, oh, what if they don't like me? Or what if I don't like them fully? <laughs> you got to focus on the, on the good part about this. When you're manifesting and you're manifesting right now, Divine Masculine, you got to focus on your positive thoughts and not your fears right now. That's the only way to get through these obstacles, these challenges in your mind. Because it's just mental. Your heart is speaking loud and clear is what I'm hearing. But you're in your mind. Remember that your mind and your heart have to be connected in order for your intuition to properly work, okay? All right, what's the outcome for Divine Masculine? We got transformation here, okay? Tower moment. This is all a test. You, you might be going through a lot of things right now, okay? And that's what's got your mind all over the place. But your heart still knows what it wants and it's speaking loudly. I'm hearing that you're trying to turn your heart off, but it won't turn off. And that's gonna that's causing transformation moments, okay? That's causing you to really, really, you know, get through some things, all right? Get through a lot of things, okay? So you got to calm that mind down and really listen to your heart because it's screaming right now. And I'm hearing that it's screaming right now, which is interesting because usually the best advice comes as a small, faint voice. It's like, yeah, you know, don't do that. Like, uh, angels and father, everybody, they don't yell, okay? <laughs> the, best, the best thing you have to do is quiet yourself in your thoughts and meditate. But I'm hearing that this right now is sparking every, like, being in your, 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 every atom in your being is what I'm hearing. So your heart is really, really piping up louder than it usually even does, okay? So listen to your heart is what Father's saying, okay? Bottom of the deck, energy is accelerated motion. That's the eight of wands. Something's happening very quickly. And that's so interesting because it reminds me of the card uh, yesterday that Divine Feminine got, which was the star card. You know, she's guiding you home, wishing on a star, and here you come in. So remember that whatever you wish for, pray for, manifest, it comes to life. So again, speak life into the situation. Don't always think so negatively. All right, let's get a, a animal, spirit animal support card for you today, Divine Masculine. What's a spirit animal for Divine Masculine today? Ah, we got the white stag. White stag always represents coming home, y'all. Union, okay? That's crazy. But you're the protector. You're an old soul. Your best friend is nature. So get outside. It says, use your intuition to take you where you want to go. Awaken the powerful voice within you. You are meant to create blessings within your magic. So as you create, as you protect your thoughts in your mind, know that this is all destined to happen. The white stag is all you, Divine Masculine, okay? Let's get a, a, a enchanted map card. Where do you go from here, Father? Where does Divine Masculine go from here? Where does Divine Masculine go from here? And we got peaks of joy, okay? <laughs> I find that interesting because um, I just, you know, I keep thinking of that song, Wishing on a Star. So you're having these moments where you know that your heart is really speaking to you loud and clear, okay? Peaks of joy. You're thinking about this seriously. This person brings you happiness, true, true happiness. I'm hearing they make you smile a lot. They make you feel like, I just heard this song by Usher where he's like, I'm a kid again, I feel like 13. But I mean, since we fell in love, girl, I'll be, I'll be your groupie, baby. Cause you are my superstar. I'm your number one fan. Give me your autograph. Sign it right here on my heart. <laughs> 
that's how you're feeling to my masculine. I find that so cute, okay? Oh, what I wanted to do was get a, a, a shadow message. So let's see what's going on in your shadow side, though. Because I'm very interested to know how your negative thoughts are impacting this, okay? And all of these cards fell. So, like, look, something doesn't want me to get into the shadow part. I'm only going to pull one card, though. Y'all know I don't get too deep into all of that. But this is the shadow answers or whatever. Let's see what hidden messages in your shadow side. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. That's what you want to say to your divine feminine. Everything that's going on, every kind of doubt that you're having in your head, you just really want to apologize. Wow. Because you see them as your light. You make they make you happy so much. And you just want to make them happy. So you're sorry that you can't make them happy currently right now. Wow. Give me a twin flame card for divine masculine. Growth. I feel insecurity is pushing me to grow, okay? So you do feel a little bit of insecurities around this subject, okay, around your person. But like I said at the beginning, those are your obstacles that you have to face, that you have to be triumphant over. You have to feel like you are worthy enough. You are, you know, you are, okay? Because immediately in the channel message, all I heard was somewhere in my youth or childhood, I must have done something good. You don't even feel like you deserve this kind of love, but you do. You absolutely do. So, yeah, it all makes sense to you. It all makes sense. This person is your happiness. They make you feel like a child. <laughs> That's so crazy because this child is on this card, and I just can't keep stop thinking about that. And the stag, the white stag, is coming home, okay? Let's see what you like to tell your divine feminine here. Divine feminine, you're the queen of swords. You are the strongest person I know. That's what you're telling your divine feminine. That's why you want to apologize because you're like, you put them through so much. Whatever the case may be, you, you recognize the strength and, and the love within them, okay? And that's a beautiful place to be because you recognize both traits. You recognize how strong they can be, but also how sweet. And um, I'm hearing like, a, what, am I, what am I trying to say? Soft. <laughs> so even though they're strong, they're soft in your eyes because they really, really love on you, okay? Unexplainably. That's what I have for you, Divine Masculine. Let's go to Divine Feminine. Thank you so much for your time.